So to get started, the first thing that you should consider is if there is anything in the scene that you have previously already stylized, because you can transfer stylizations between files. So in our case, we have already stylized the two characters, so we can bring that in. Using the toolbox, we can come here and say import. I have a shot here. I've already exported this. And when I export this, you're going to see the stylization is successfully imported, but you won't be seeing any of the two characters here. And this is because the namespace has changed. Now, if you want to check that out here, you will see that it, the, the tool can't really find the, uh, the objects in the scene. And that's because there's a new namespace here. Now, when I exported this, um, they didn't have a namespace. So we need to take that into account. So now when we import, we want to change a namespace from no namespace to domo and toti1, which is the namespace that we have here. Once we have that in, go back to our shot and we import the stylization. And then the tool will do its magic and it will bring back the stylization. Now, as you can see, the characters as such are very very blown out and that's because the lighting in the scene is set very differently in fact there's way too many lights for what mnprx needs so let's get that cleaned up we have this uh, light here which is our main light our key light we're going to keep that but the rest we're going to build so we delete this and now we have a much better starting point now something that you might notice as well is that we are not doing any color correction. And when these characters were stylized, they were color corrected. So let's bring that back in. Color management, enable color management. And once we have that, we have something much closer to what we actually started with when we began stylizing these characters.